Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be recording my pre-poo routine. Well, another pre-poo routine. I uh, went ahead and bought the African Pride Moisture Miracle Aloe and Coconut Water Detangle and Condition pre-shampoo this is a product that i've seen around and a lot of people say a lot of good things about it i've used it once before and i really do love the way the product works on my hair so yeah i'm just going to show you guys how i use it in my pre poo routine and what i really think of the product and how i get on with it so let's get straight into this video so yeah this is what my hair is looking like crispy and dry so i'm going to part my hair into four and i'm not trying to get an accurate part just trying to part the hair where it naturally wants to separate. Right, so I'm just gonna start in this back section here. As you can see, it's looking really matted. I am gonna be doing my curly to straight routine after this, and I usually would just go into the shower and just start washing my hair, but because it is so knotty and dry, I don't wanna just go straight into my routine. I wanna make sure that it's nourished and moisturized before I do that. So yeah, this, is really going to help with that. It's got aloe vera and coconut water in it. I have done aloe vera before. I've done my curly to straight routines before and the shine on that hair is amazing. So hopefully this product will be a good replacement for the aloe vera that I like to use sometimes. So I'm just going to start by completely drenching my hair with the water. It'll be easier if you just wet your hair in the shower quickly and part your hair off like so. But for video purposes, I'm just going to spray the hell out of my hair. So yeah, let's go. And now it's quite wet. <laughs> and I'm just gonna smooth that through my hair and just really start to try and separate the biggest knots. So, spray a little bit more. I've just put a towel on my lap here because this product does tend to get a little bit messy and no drippy. So you don't wanna, I'm on my bed, so I don't wanna mess up my bed at all. So yeah, I'm just gonna <laughs> open it. And this is what the product looks like. Nice and slippy. And honestly guys, look how easy that was. I mean, it's not finished yet, but look how easy my fingers were able to gl glide through my hair. It's got so much slip, it's unbelievable. And this product is curly girl friendly as well. I've checked the ingredients out online. Uh, none of those products that's gonna, you know, just sit on your curls and build up and be hard to wash out. I usually just finger detangle my hair, but because this product has so much lip, I do actually feel comfortable enough to put the brush through it. So that's what I'm gonna do now. So I'm gonna take this brush that I have here. So this is my ideal detangling brush, but you can use any brush that you feel comfortable detangling your hair with. And I'm just gonna start from the ends all the way up to my roots. See how easy that was? So much slip. I think this is probably the most slip I've ever got from a product before. So yeah, if you have trouble with um, detangling your hair and you just need a product that's got a lot of slip, more slip than what a conditioner has, this is the product. Really, really good. So as I said, I don't usually use a brush in my pre-poo routine. I just usually 
like to use my fingers all the way through but I feel comfortable to use the brush on my hair. If you want to, you can actually add a little bit of conditioner in that water bottle to provide even more slip. So yeah, really, really good. I do think this product will be good for every hair type as well, just because, I mean, who doesn't like slip? <laughs> so as you can see, like my hair is not dripping wet. It's not even wetting up my t-shirt that much. It's just literally the product's got so much slip in it to be able to just literally glide my fingers through just like that look at the comparison so that's the back part of my hair and that's the part that's not done so once I'm done I just like to twist it up so that it doesn't get tangled again and I'm just going to move on to the next section and then break my fingers through and just wiggle my fingers if I feel any knots. So like here, there's a knot, I just wiggle my fingers like that. And I find that interlocking my fingers is the best way for me to finger detangle my hair. So yeah, that's one side done. Very, very happy. Honestly guys, that was so easy. And I do feel like my hair has got a little bit thinner because my hair never used to be able to detangle so quickly. Like even without using this product, my hair usually takes forever to detangle, like on a good day. Like I can't complain because it's not thin. It's still got volume to it. So I'm just gonna move on to this side get through this as quickly as possible because I've got so much to do today. So knotty, look at that. It's so knotty. Gets so messy as well, like it drips everywhere. So just be aware of that. So yeah, as soon as you put it in, you immediately can start to finger detangle your hair. You're just giving me that slip straight away. <laughs> Before, when I had the water in it, I wasn't able to put my fingers through it at all because it was so knotty. So yeah, I'm just going to break up these big knots, finger detangle as much as I can before I go in with the brush. Also, has anyone tried the Tangle Teaser before? I recently just bought one. I'm going to pick it up tomorrow and review it. I am happy with my Easy to Tangler brush. I don't even know if they're a real company anymore. I don't see them on Instagram. So yeah, but this is the Easy to Tangler brush really really happy with it but you can actually get a cheaper version of this brush on amazon let's go with my brush now and just detangling really really slowly as well because you don't want to well i don't want to break any more of my hair since it's decided to fall out i really didn't think that postpartum hair fall got me really bad but it's because i had a lot of hair in my head i didn't recognize how much hair i lost but the density has really really changed what my density is usually like i'll say this part of my hair usually has like a third more hair and also that's the main reason why i like to finger detangle more than using a brush is because it reduces the amount of hair for what it has for me i don't see a lot of hair coming out when i finger detangle my hair at all so i'm using the brush today and there's not a lot of hair that's come out actually so i think this product is really really good for hair fall as well because it's just gliding through i'll show you how much hair at the end it's not that much for a wash and go that's well it's only four days old actually my wash and go but it was really knotty and usually when my hair is really knotty there's a lot of hair fall that comes along with it but not today <laughs> and also you'll find that a lot of the tangles that's in the hair is hair that's fallen out and that's just been caught up in the hair. Right, so that's all done. Let me show you guys how much hair came out. Literally, that's all that came out of my hair. It's only been four days since I had my wash and go in, but it was really, really knotty. So that amount 
is healthy for me. My hair is really long, so the longer the hair is, the more it's gonna bunch up into a ball. So yeah, that's not that much for me. So yeah, the instructions say to leave in for 15 to 30 minutes before rinsing and follow up with the Moisture Miracle Nourish and Shine Shampoo. But I mean, it's been about 15 minutes now since I've been recording anyway. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wash it out straight away because I've got a lot of other videos to do for my curly to straight routine. And the time is jogging on, so better get to it. But yeah, that is the African Pride Moisture Miracle Aloe and Coconut Water Tisangle on Condition Pre Shampoo. And as you can see, I've used a considerable amount. You can see the level now. So I'd say I have about maybe two to three more uses out of this, which will equal five uses. And I only use about that much water in my hair. I'd say the more water, the better, which means you can probably use a little less product. And also you can add conditioner to your water as well to give it more slip so you don't have to use as much product. But yeah, that is the African Pride Free Shampoo and I'm really, really happy with my results and the way it worked in my hair. And it just made my detangling process a breeze, literally a breeze. So if you usually have problems detangling your hair or your daughter's hair or your cousin's hair or your mother's hair and you're in the shower for ages detangling your hair, um, try this product out. I think it will really, really help and you won't be in the shower for five hours trying to detangle your hair. <laughs> I bought this one for $5.99, which is a fair price, I guess. Um, I think hair products under five pounds are probably the products you shouldn't buy because you know they'll probably have more rubbish ingredients in them anyway. So yeah, $5.99 is it's an okay range. I don't mind the brand itself, African Pride. I do think they have some products that are quite all right and I did used to use the hair grease from them back in the day that I really liked but yeah that's the end of the video guys if you enjoyed don't forget to give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below if it helped you out in any way and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as well I'm almost there guys to be monetized and I think I'm falling behind a little bit on my subscriber count so if you could subscribe to my channel that would really really help me out um but yeah thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one bye